Welcome. In the next few minutes, you will learn how to fix your motherboard's HDMI port when it stops working. Let's begin troubleshooting. First, we need to check the physical connection between your motherboard and the display. Make sure the HDMI cable is properly plugged into both your motherboard and your monitor. To eliminate the possibility of a faulty cable, try using a different HDMI cable if you have one. If the cable seems fine, try a different HDMI port on your motherboard. Sometimes, the issue stems from outdated software that controls your graphics. Go to your motherboard or graphics cart manufacturer's website and download the latest drivers for your system. Once downloaded, install the new drivers to ensure your graphics system is up to date. Next, we need to check a crucial setting in your BIOS. Access your BIOS settings by restarting your computer and pressing the designated key during startup, usually Dell F or F. Within the BIOS menu, locate the settings for onboard graphics or EAT and ensure that the HDMI output is enabled. If it's already enabled, you can try disabling and re-enabling it to see if that resolves the issue. Sometimes a simple reset can resolve unexpected issues. To reset your BIOS, power off your computer completely. Locate the CMOS battery on your motherboard. It's a small round battery. Remove the CMOS battery and wait a few minutes before reinserting it. This process will reset your BIOS settings to their defaults. Hardware conflicts can also interfere with your HDMI output. Open your computer case and check for any devices, such as PCI Express cards, that might be conflicting with your HDMI output. Try removing or disabling any unnecessary devices to see if it resolves the HDMI issue. If you have a dedicated graphics card installed, receipting it can sometimes resolve connection problems. Power off your computer and carefully remove the graphics card from its slot on the motherboard. Ensure the card is free from dust and debris, then reinsert it firmly back into the slot, making sure it's securely connected. To determine if the problem lies with your monitor or your motherboard, connect your computer to a different monitor using the same HDMI cable. If the issue persists with a different monitor, it's more likely a problem with the motherboard. If you've exhausted all troubleshooting steps, it's best to reach out to your motherboard manufacturer for further assistance. They can guide you through additional troubleshooting steps or advise on potential repair or replacement options. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more such tutorials.